This is it. This Sunday, students hit Lake Wendaree for a race they'll never forget. No heats, no second chances. These teenagers row for a place in the history book of their school and their city. Well, this Sunday we've got the Head of the Lake happening, so that's at the event that we've been training all season for. Oh, there's definitely a bit of hardcore rivalry. Um, yeah, no, it should be good. We're all very nervous, very excited. We're ready out there to create a storm amongst the field and change things up a bit. For many students, this will be their last Head of the Lake. Making the win means so much more. I'd be a very happy man. <laughs> be very happy. And just you be happy or? Uh, the crew would be happy, the high school would be happy. It's been 13 years since we last won the, won the boys head of the lake. So it'd be a pretty, pretty big thing. Yeah. Very big actually. I want to make the most of it. Like I want to go out on a high, make sure I make the most of my last season. Very nervous. It's very daunting. Um, yeah, no, it's something to look forward to, definitely. So, I think, I'm not going to say we've got a good chance, but I think we've all worked our hardest and, yeah, I think we'll be up there, hopefully. I'm going to go out there and try my best on the day and if that's good enough, then that's good enough. Standing at the finish line at Lake Wendere, oh, yeah. these competitive rowers are just thinking about what it's going to feel like to cross that line this Sunday. The last 250, we'll be pushing it hard and I know that it'll be a struggle to concentrate on where we are. It's all going to be a blur on the weekend, so... Oh, I'm just picturing coming down the last 250. You'll be able to hear the roar from 500 metres out, and yeah, it's an amazing feeling. This is Nicole Cairns with The Courier.